This video shows you how to create a costing template. You'll be able to see the value of any time recorded if staff are using timesheets and tag sets. We'll start by clicking on the settings button at the top of the screen and go down to templates. Click the plus button on the top right. Enter a name for this one, it's just going to be called costing template. Under template type, choose costing. The company must be on the premium plan for this to work. So I'm just going to upgrade us straight away. And now we're going to select what we're costing with. We're costing with jobs. If you want to see the KiwiSaver value in one total, click group all to one cost. But in this case, I'm going to split it between the jobs. And here I'm just selecting the most common options that are normally applied. And now that we've created the costing template, we're going to apply it to the payroll. Go to run a pay and go to the edit pencil at the top of the screen next to the date. You'll see that we have a new costing field to select. Click the select option and choose the costing template name. Then select OK. Now we've told the system that we're going to be costing with the jobs and all the jobs that Jenny has recorded will be now showing in our template area in the finalised screen. So I'm going to calculate these two pay cards and show you what it looks like. So we'll go up to finalise and now we can see a new costing heading here. You can see the milking maintenance and stock control costings for the time worked. But you can't see any costings for Ryan Wilkins as he didn't have any timesheets recorded. But I can fix this for Ryan if I set up a home department for him and assign all his payments to the home department. Under settings and tag sets and jobs, I've clicked on add tags and created a new tag called manager. Now I'm going to assign it to him. So I'll select Ryan's name, go to Tag Set under Details, and select under Jobs that he is the manager. I'm applying that tag to his name. Everything that he earns will now be costed to that department. So Jenny's costing is with timesheets, and Ryan's is by default to his home department. I'll go back to Run a Pay. Finalise and costing. And now we can see all of the costings and the total of the pay matches up. You can download a little report here too. If you click the down arrow here and choose detail, it'll give you a CSV file splitting out all the information for all the staff separately.